Yo! That's not the only thing I can do with my throat. Man, what is good with y'all? Super ah! Ultra from the Vault Clan. We're back with another video. This time, we are reacting to Naruto Unhinged Episode 9, Orochimaru, the Diddy Disciple. Now, this is based off of that title and also based off of the creepiest thumbnail. I'm not gonna lie to you. The most A yo thumbnail I ever seen in my life. This has to go back to when Orochimaru was in the forest with Sasuke uh, and he was sucking on Sasuke's neck. Orochimaru is the nastiest, slimiest PDF file. If Orochimaru was in our timeline, in our universe, he would be caught on camera trying to meet a 14 year old at a Best Buy. He would have been caught. He had been trying to run down the aisle, getting smacked up and beat up. I can see that, bro. I can see that. But look, with all that being said, uh, it's a 26 minute vid. Don't want to waste too much of your time. So we're going to stop wasting that. You feel me? And let's get straight to it. Or any other series related to it. This video is a parody for entertainment purposes and for the enjoyment of fans that follow the original series. But with all that said, please enjoy the video. First, yeah. Episode 9, Orochimaru, the Diddy Disciple. Hear me out, though. Disclaimer. I'm playing. I'm playing. Everything said in this video are just jokes and not meant to be taken seriously. Okay. These are literally just fictional characters. That's facts. And they do not accurately reflect anyone in real life. Facts. So YouTube moderators, chill on me. Chill. <laughs> then Nick snuck me while I had my meat out. Oh yeah, I remember now. I remember. Damn. Damn it. He dropped a paper bomb, then ran away. What a bitch. Listen, you two. We need a password. Because what just happened was unacceptable. Especially you getting caught lacking with your dick out. Which could have led to us losing our scroll. Oh my god, yo. I get it, my n****. Just move on from it. To make sure this password is strong, it needs to be something only the three of us would know. Okay, okay. okay. What do you think it should be? I think it should be the same exact question Naruto asked at the start of our first ever team meeting. I don't want my money and business perspective question being passed around like a thought. So I'm going to need to hear your reasoning before Whoa. I even consider agreeing to this. What was the first question? Think about it, Naruto. When you first asked the question, the only other person there besides us was Kakashi. And plus, we all gave different answers. So if we make those same exact answers the correct ones for our password, then it'll be easy to tell if one of us is being impersonated. Full circle. Because that person most likely won't answer it the same exact okay, way. Okay, fine. <laughs> he cut his ass off. He said, hey, bro, like, calm down, bro. Oh, he got hit with a rock? Naruto cut that man smooth off. <laughs> he was like, bro, stop all that yapping. I understand. He won't answer it the same exact okay, way. Okay, fine. I get it, my new... What the... Oh my god, Damn. please tell me you're okay, my glorious king. I don't even need to ask you the password, because it's very obvious you're the same person. Unfortunately. Yo, are you guys okay? That wind really teed up on a n Stop. I can just tell. Are you guys okay? That sound like a Rochimaru, bro. That's not him. That's not Naruto. Would you suck a d for a billion dollars? Come on, my n Of course not. Ooh. And, I'm and we know he would even attempt to impersonate my teammate and still answer his own question wrong. And we know damn well Naruto's sucking the meat off the bone. We know this already, bruh. We know what Naruto about to do, bruh. We he gonna go to work for that money, bruh. We already know this. And for him to answer that, bro, he's a he's he's Naruto in disguise. You're probably the same bitch from earlier. Ooh. So how about we have our round two right here and now? Mm, I like when you call me that word. Oh my god. This isn't the same person. I've been waiting for our little session to happen for a while now. Session? Yes, that's I swear you can't make this up. I really gotta sit here with this n***a's balls on my face. Uh. I didn't even have the chance to defend myself. Because as soon as I got up after getting sent flying, I turn around and get shoved into this thing's mouth. Oh, my God. Now I just feel like a victim. Victim or not, at least a nigga still got that jollof rice on him. 
I'm not eating nothing in that predicament. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. That's nasty. I can feel the tension between all of us right now. That's like eating in the in like the bathroom, like bro. No, that's even that's worse than eating. That's like eating a porta potty. Like why are you pulling out your rice pocket? Like like why are you pulling out your rice and there's slime everywhere? You said your the the ball your your smush between balls. Like why would you even? That was dumb. But I can't tell if it's the normal type of tension, or if it's something else. But I think I would prefer it to be the latter. She has the scroll type we need to be able to go to the next exam. Hmm, I can sense you two are getting ready to attack me for this scroll. But that type yeah. of foreplay is boring. So, how about I spice things up for us before we begin our little session? The way she talks makes me uncomfortable. Bro, I was about to and say the same thing. By... I feel so uncomfortable, bro. I feel kind of uh, uneasy. Spice things up. Yo! What the f Yo! That's not the only thing I can do with my throat. But we can get into that later. Just know the only way this scroll is coming out is if you force it out of me. What? Oh, they got hit with a... Is something wrong? Again, you too. Oh, God. This isn't just a random person. This is another predator. But this isn't like the one from the Land of Waves. Because I can literally feel her lust for freakiness. Oh, how cute. He's too afraid to move. I like when they get submissive <laughs> on me. That is wild. Damn it. She can't even move a single muscle. She's in more shock than me. There's no need to breathe so heavily, my little prince. Because all you're doing is making me more bricked. If that's the right term you kids say now. But anyways, just know I'm only here for you. She's not even a thought in my mind. So, you have my full attention, my baby boy. Baby Those boy. Those two nicknames she just gave me make me feel disgusting. Man. Wait, what the f*** does she mean by more bricked? When you say more bricked, does that basically confirm that you're actually a dude? Hmm, I'm whatever you want me to be. What the hell does that even mean? That's enough talking for now. I'm itching to start our session. So how Stop about saying I start session. off with some casual BDSM? You know what? F*** all that ethical shit. Yeah. I could have done this from the start, but I didn't want to be the one to do this to another male. I got places to be though. Which way to do? So say goodbye, cause your balls are about to be emasculated and eviscerated. What are you about to do? Shadow clone jutsu. Oh, imagine, yo, imagine if that if that was like your balls. Like imagine this is the boys. Y'all seen the boys, right? The boys, uh, the show, the boys, right? They had like this small dude, this, this person that can like like shrink, and he went inside the dudes, and then he grew, and then the dudes everywhere. That's the same visual I had just now. I need to start thinking things through a little more because I just made a snake bust, literally, and I guess metaphorically <laughs> too. Now hey. his juices are all over me. My he nigga, already in I get you're the main body and all, but you making us do that was mad gay. Which one of you niggas just said that? Because I could really make all of you beat my meat right now if I what? wanted to. Then you would what? really know what gay is. Why? Ah, oh, that's crazy. Interesting. I guess he isn't interested in BDSM. That's okay, though, because I like when they're scrambling and scraping. What? This can't be real. My glorious king looks scared. This is bad. We only got away due to my sheer willpower to protect my streak. This creep is a top-tier pedo. What if I told you that this wasn't a snake? Oh! That look in your eyes just made me squirt myself. Whoa! You're a grown-ass man talking about squirting in front of two kids. Facts. Nigga, you're a certified pedophile. Nah, for real. How annoying. <laughs> Things like, were just getting good. He played good. that not like a... <laughs> Naruto, stay back. This one is different from the regular ones. 
Ain't no way this nigga is scared right now. Yup. Don't worry about him. He just isn't used to Hey, yo, to this what's up with his legs? Style yet. Why his legs look like that? Yo, I'm done with this animation. I forgot how goofy this shit look. Like, why? Why? I get he's like in a snake form, but deep, but we did not need to see that. I ain't gonna lie. They could have put his legs like underneath the tree a little bit. Under, like underneath that branch, like wrap it around a little bit more because that just looks goofy. Come on now. Yet. I'll make sure to go easy on him. This is the shit I'm talking about. That. That right there. He's different. He's exactly how I expect a creep like him to act. The only difference I see here is that Sasuke is the target. Yep. And of course, he doesn't like it. Yep. This was a nice little team reunion, but I think it's time for me and Sasuke to continue where we left off. Keep your freaky ass away from him! This is how I expect my glorious king to be acting right now. But instead, he's over there looking traumatized. Yeah. Listen up. Uh -oh. I'll give you our scroll if you just leave us alone. Yo, Wait, he what is, are you doing? He is Shut scared. Up, Naruto, I'm stopping us from getting violated. Wow. I can't believe I'm about to say this, but th that's not my king. Hmm, yes. He's being submissive again. Just take it and leave. Ooh. Naruto said, bro, what are you doing, bro? This is the mission. This is this is the task at hand. You just gonna throw it to him like like that? We didn't even really fight the nigga yet, and you already afraid, bro. You, you're afraid because all the attention is going to you, and he's he's about to take your ass. That's why you're afraid. Let's just be honest. I wonder how things would have went if he would have got that scroll, and Sasuke never got bit. He wouldn't be strong enough. I ain't gonna lie. Why can't you just listen? Shut the fuck up, nigga. I thought you always wanted to look good in front of the hose. There's yeah. one sitting right next to us. But you're over here scared for your life. Yep. This isn't like you at all. Nope. You're folding under pressure for and sure. scaring the hose away. Most definitely. No, I'm not. My nigga, just look at her. She hasn't glazed you once since you started acting like this. And she's your number one meat rider. Facts. So that should tell you something. Facts. Yeah, sit there and think about that. I plan on passing these exams no matter what. So if I gotta handle this situation like a real nigga all by myself, then that's what I'll do. You're getting in the way of my little play date with Sasuke, so I'll make sure you finish quickly. This nigga just doesn't stop being freaky. Wind style, Diddy speech, no. Jutsu. Man, you doing it, man. You deserve it, Daddy. Diddy? How was bro not arrested? Diddy is still out there somewhere just doing his thing. Like, bro, how is he not arrested for what been going on? They ain't got no proof or nothing like that? Like, what's happening, bro? What this nigga gotta say, bro? You know, the third always got some... The third be talking shit, so let's see what he gotta say. Orochimaru should have made it into the forest by this point. I had a secret meeting with him outside oh the village the night God. before I announced the real nigga exams, and we came to an agreement. I don't, like I don't this know nigga. if I can fully trust him, but as long as he stays true to our deal, then I can finally get this last one up on that oh gas nigga Minato. What? For someone with so much confidence, what? I would have expected you to last longer. Fuck you, you Michael Jackson wannabe ass nigga. I'm just getting started. Mmm, I like when they get mad oh, because weird. that causes them to get more aggressive with me. And I love when they get aggressive and toss me around like a piece of meat. No, he's weird. So what can I say to make him more mad? You of all people should know how petty I am. So I want you to break his ego. I want you to let that little nigglet know that he'll never amount to shit. Before you do the deed, you know he's gonna turn up. That would be perfect. From what I learned so far, Naruto seems like a prideful person, so those words should touch all up inside him very, very deeply. Yep. <laughs> he doesn't have to say that. Listen up, little boy, because I don't have all day. I'm not about to waste any more time on someone who won't amount to shit in life, Woo! let alone be anything worth remembering. So, how about you hurry up and die, you little waste of space and breath? 
Mm. Naruto, don't listen to him. It's not I'm true. I'm sick and tired of niggas trying to play me. But you know what? Uh, too late. You can think whatever you want, fuck nigga. Because at the end of the day, I'm still going to be the realest nigga, nigga you've ever come across. Oh! Oh my god, his voice. It just changed. Let's go. The nine cut black man. Hmm. How unexpected. Hiruzen didn't tell me it was inside of him. Uh, Looks like there will be a change in my plans. For now, let's see how aggressive he can get. Mm, yes, hit me harder. He's enjoying this. Boy, throwing them hands, ain't he? Mm, I'm very satisfied and stimulated right now. I'll find a way to incorporate him in. Bro, I can't listen to this nigga talk, bro. It's just too much. It's literally making me feel weird, bro. You're you, Barack, Obezi, bro. You you a freaky ass nigga, bro. You a fan. You a freaky ass nigga. Cause you voiced this. I'm pretty. You voiced this, right? Look. That's some freaky ass shit you've been doing, bro. Hiruzen didn't tell me it was inside of him. Looks like there will be a change in my plans. Oh, wow. For now, let's see how aggressive he can get. Mmm, yes, hit me harder. Man, the animation was. What the hell? Also, this is edited mm, by Barack. I'm very satisfied and stimulated right now. I'll find a way to incorporate him into my plan later on down the road. But for now, I need to get back to my main target, baby boy Sasuke. I need to hurry and check on that group. Because something that one of them said earlier is really starting to bother me. That's understandable. You're a little too old for my liking anyways. Yes, yeah, weird. God damn it, I'm What's so weird? stupid because I passed it off as a joke at the time. But when I started to think about it, I realized that I only know one person that could say uh, something disgusting uh. like that so casually. And to make things worse, that tongue they had was a dead giveaway, and I missed it like a fucking dumbass. I think it's crazy how like Orochimaru, like he has this fit, like he got he got the uh you know, the uh the the purple ropes, he got the little you know, the I don't know like the light brown, you know, light brown white type of like shirt and pants, and it's like bro, how you not know who he is? Did he wear something different back in the day? Like how can you not tell who that is when you've been bit by him before? It's not make sense whatsoever. That was fun while it lasted, but your friend will be out for a little bit. So I think it's finally time I help you expand your horizons a little bit. If you get what I'm hinting at. Oh God, don't tell me. Why the hell won't he do anything? There's no He's way scared. this is who I've been calling my king. So I'm thinking it's time I introduce your body to a new feeling and make you feel every single inch of my giant snake. Oh, boy. As much as I like your persistence, you're becoming annoying. This is the second time you delayed me from touching that sweet young man. Nigga, you get No, for real. Mm, yes, there's no doubt about it. Just off that line alone, I can tell that's definitely the beast. Tighten up and start fighting, cause you's looking like a bitch. Let's go. Why do you randomly start sounding like this? You probably just scared he finna snatch them cheeks up, huh? Yeah, yeah. What's wrong? Scared you're gonna get your cheeks snatched? Oh, he, oh, he told him that too? Unfortunately, that's exactly what it's looking like. I was gonna do way more than just that. What? Uh, 
I wish I could see the look on Hiruzen's face when he finds out I went back on our deal. Because after learning what's inside of you, I think I'll keep you alive so I can try something later on. But I'm running on limited time now because of all your little interruptions. Mm. So I think it's time I put you to sleep for a little bit. Hiruzen is the third Hokage's name. So what is he even talking about? I'm gonna tighten up the seal on the beast so you don't run around and get yourself killed before I get what I want out of you. Oh, wow. So I'm gonna use a technique that involves me fingering your stomach. What? It may seem strange, but trust me, the feeling is amazing. Mmm. Mm. Okay, yes, nigga, shut up, shut up, shut up. Oh, I listen to you. <laughs> See, why couldn't Sasuke act like this? Instead, he's either just standing there or getting scared. It's almost embarrassing. What, what are you doing, I though? I hope you're ready. What is she doing? Because this finger technique is different than that casual stuff most people do to each other. Sasuke, why are you just standing there? Go help him! Bro, you're standing there as well. What are you doing? Dang! What did he just do to me? Nigga, get your white ass out my crib. Huh? Wow. Wow. Oh my god, what did you just do to him? Damn it, he's taking our scroll. Yeah, we're cooked. No, we're not. Okay. I see you, girl. Nah, I'm getting sick of this. What the f is wrong with you? You're acting like a completely different person. Naruto saved you twice and you let him get touched by that freak over there. Yep. Then you have the nerve to sit there and almost watch him fall to his death? Right. You're not my king. You're just a fraud. Damn. I'm embarrassed to say I ever called you my glorious king, but it's okay. You're still glorious. She can't help herself. A glorious bitch. Oh, 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 oh! I wasn't waiting for that. I was not expecting that. I was, I was not expecting that. Oh, hey, she cooked on that one. She cooked, bro. She cooked. Look at him, looking stupid. Go ahead, bro. Square up, bro. Square up, bro. Let's not get too crazy on my baby boy, you little pink-haired thought. She's lucky I don't find any interest in her gender anymore. Wow. I would have had to step in and teach her a lesson. Sasuke. I was your number one meat rider. Hell, I was probably the best to ever do it. But after seeing how you acted today, I can't let myself glaze someone that behaves like this. You're scaring the So host. as my final goodbye to whatever this one-sided relationship was, I will glaze you. One last time. Okay. Sasuke, my glorious king. You are my reason to live, my reason to breathe. You are my everything. You are the shining and shimmering light to this world's darkness. You are the best ninja out of our generation and soon to be the greatest ninja in all the great oh, that's nations. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Everything you do is heavenly to me. Yes, sir. I wanted to be the chair when you sit down. I wanted to be the table when you eat. I even wanted to be the air that you breathe. Before today, you were literally perfect to me. But of course, things change. So, as my final words of glaze, I want you to stand proud, my glorious king. You are strong. Damn it. What have I been doing? I've been selling my team this whole time. There we go. And because of that, Naruto literally got fingered by that freak over there. <laughs> but what's he? <laughs> Yo, hey, he needed that. I needed that. I, I need to wake up like every morning. Not every morning, but I, I just need to hear that every once in a while. You know what I'm saying? Like, that was a good way to motivate him. Look at him. He thinking about it. Let's go. Turn up. Turn up. Let's go. It's even worse. I looked like a bitch in front of one of my most loyal meat riders. Axe. And now, I lost her. 
I think it's time I start pulling my weight. So thank you for that last bit of glazing you just did. I needed that. That was cute, I guess. But I think it's time we move on to the climax of our session. Bro, fast. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo! Hmm, a, like a I'm a little straight. disappointed. Oh, I thought you would have lasted longer. How could I be finished if I didn't even blow your back out yet? What? What? Hmm, I like the sound of that. How about I get in position for you right now? Then you can go crazy on me. Oh, I see what he did there. Blow the back out. Mmm, yes, Sasuke. Pull harder. Now this is the Sasuke I'm used to. My mark is starting to ache. I must be getting close. I'm mainly worried about the kids, though, because Orochimaru wouldn't just show up without a motive, so I need to get there before he does anything similar to what he did to me. That mark I just put on your shoulder is a symbol of my victims. But unfortunately, you didn't satisfy my urges. Damn. So this is where our little session ends. Sasuke, are you okay? That was a big attack you just did. I thought you said you weren't going to glaze me anymore. I'm not. I'm just stating the obvious. Oh. Well, I don't know how I'm feeling. That took up a lot of my chakra so I can barely move right now. Hmm. So basically, that means you emptied your whole load on, on me, me with, with that, that last attack. Oh. Oh my god. Their voice just changed. Damn it. How the hell is he still alive? That really satisfied me. So that will put an end to our session. And because I'm so satisfied, I think you deserve a reward. But in order to receive it, there needs to be a sacrifice. Damn it, he's burning our scroll. And now that the sacrifice is taken care of, I think it's time I give you your reward. No! Sound like an apple. Did he just bite him? Yep. You have now been marked as one of my victims. You may not realize this now, but I just gave you a gift. What the f*** did you just do to me? I feel my nut flow and pathways changing. Like I just said, I gave you a gift, my sweet little prince. Why, though? I didn't ask for whatever you just did to me. Why? Oh, that's simple. It's because you deserve it, Daddy. God damn it. My nut pathways have fully closed off, Daddy and I feel crazy. my consciousness slipping. Please, just promise me one thing. Don't do what you said you were going to do earlier while I'm unconscious. Please. That's all I ask. What is he talking about? So I'm thinking I might extract some honey from the beehive when he's sleeping, if you know what I mean. Wow. Oh my god, Sasuke. She said that? I was just trying to make her jealous. I wasn't actually serious. Oh, yeah, Why yeah, would yeah. I ever ruin something so important to you? Well, she was talking to Eno. Actually, promise me one more thing. Promise me that you'll protect Naruto while I'm unconscious. I owe him big time. He's out cold. I promise, Sasuke. Mm, it's so nice to see you again. But if you came here to stop me, you're already too late. I was actually on my way out. You're not going anywhere until you tell me what happened. I'm pretty sure we both know what happened. I found another victim and marked him. But this one's different. He's actually special and has meaning. Unlike you. Oh, what's wrong? Are you jealous? Sorry to tell you, but I don't go for your gender anymore. 
Bro, I could care less about your sexual orientation, you dirty bastard. Right. Just tell me where the kid is and why you're here. Oh, look at baby Anko. You're so feisty and demanding now. If only you were like this back then. Maybe I could have found some use for you. Or maybe you could have stopped me from giving you the Diddy treatment. This is weird. Did she get him? Speaking of that, how about I give you the same Diddy treatment that you gave to me? After all, I have you stuck, and I'm pretty sure someone like you wouldn't mind, right? You disgusting female. Don't you dare put your hands on me. What's wrong? You're supposed to be some type of super freak. I'd rather die before I touch some female genitalia again. That's crazy. Oh, oh, he, he's full on Orochi. Full fledged. Ah. That was a pretty smart tactic. If I was actually stuck, I might have actually started to panic. But I was never stuck to begin with. And you're not on my level of freakiness. So I know you would never commit an act like that. Because I'm not a sick f like you are. Was that supposed to hurt my feelings? Hmm. We both know what you said is true. I'm sick, disgusting, and nasty. Yeah, you're a freak. And I love that about myself. You're a freak. I think it's about time I head back to my freak house. While I'm gone, do me a favor and tell Haruzin that I'm up 1 0. That he should really get his blood house, boiling. Bro. He Wait. Ha. Ah. He named it the freak house. He a freak. Yeah, nigga. What? That was a pretty smart tactic. If I was actually stuck, I might have actually started to panic. But I was never stuck to begin with. And you're not on my level of freakiness. So I know you would never commit an act like that. Because I'm not a sick f like you are. Was that supposed to hurt my feelings? Damn. We both know what you said is true. I'm sick, disgusting, and nasty. And I love that about myself. I think it's about time I head back to my freak house. While I'm gone, do me a favor and tell Haruzin that I'm up 1-0. That should really get his blood boiling. He's up 1-0? I thought they was working together. Good shit. Good shit. Great episode. Great episode. Orochi Morrow, bro. I'm not gonna lie. This is canon. Like, like I said before, this is this is canon. How he's acting, how bad he wants Sasuke, how sexual this dude is. He's such a freak. Um, I really enjoyed that one. That was really good. Again, the lore, the story is is unfolding and it's great. I love how this has its own story. And um, I can't wait to see some more, bro. Keep going. It's your boy OG from the World Clan. That's my reaction. And I'm out.